Tonight, a man attorney say beat his girlfriend to the point she lost her baby will not serve any jail time. The woman and her attorney say they're afraid for her safety, and while he's been required to turn in his guns, they say that has not happened. KXN Sarah Alshay takes us inside the courtroom. You were also the first person to hold me at gunpoint, the first person to angle me. Those were the words LaShonda Lemons said aloud in court directed towards Johnny Ebbs. She says he started abusing her when she got pregnant, and when she was 32 weeks, it escalated. Ebbs punched her several times in the stomach. The baby died soon after, but you can see in this photo, she was able to hold him. Ebbs reached a plea deal with eight years of deferred adjudication on a third degree continuous family violence assault. So while we're disappointed with the ultimate outcome, it was expected and we hope it serves the better purpose of bringing attention and starting conversations about domestic violence. Ebbs was required by both his bond and an agreed upon protective order to forfeit his guns, but still to this day, McKay says that never happened. We have firearm surrender laws, we have domestic violence laws, but if there's not enforcement and implementation, of those laws, they're relatively useless. As part of the plea deal, the Travis County District Attorney's Office required Ebbs to swear in court that he doesn't have any guns and won't live in a house with them in it. McKay says based on the terms of the agreement, Ebbs will end up not serving any jail time and will wear a GPS monitor for six months. It's a decision domestic abuse advocates say does not serve justice. Well, we're very concerned that the sentencing does not result in safety for the survivor and the community. Sarah Alshah, KXAN News. KXAN reached out to the Travis County District Attorney's Office to better understand why Ebbs will not serve any jail time. We were told a statement would not be available today. And to give you some perspective here, more pregnant women die from domestic violence each year than any other cause. This is according to the National Resource Center on Domestic Violence. Their studies show nearly 20% of women experience violence during pregnancy. Researchers say pregnant teens and women with unplanned pregnancies have a higher risk of getting hurt.